What's up everyone? Sean Count Blagareth here today with my Q&A video part one. I'm gonna break this up into multiple parts because I got way too many questions. Um, first question is asked by Mr. Cannibal Sport. Which genre of music do you feel best represents the element of fire? I'm gonna have to go with uh, Bastille, Black and Death Metal. Bands like Archgo, uh, even black metal bands that played the steel style, like uh, Blasphemy, Defagio, and um, <clears throat> The Heart. Ramhammer 7, what's your favorite metal genre? Black metal. Uh, End of Will, do you agree with the statement that at black metal as we know it would not exist without Kiss? That is so wrong on so many levels that it's not even correctable. Um... <laughs> I disagree with that with every inch of my being. I feel that uh, Mayhem had more to do with the aesthetic, if that's what that statement's referring to musically. That's beyond comprehension of how wrong that is. <coughs> Philly Fan for Life 94 asks Are you Christian? Yes, but I hold different values. I don't read the Bible. I stick to the Ten Commandments, but I do not go beyond that. I use science, and uh, I live my life without judging people for what they believe. I judge them for who they are. Are you gay? No. Do you have a real job, and why do you live with your parents? Uh, first of all, it's not really anyone's business, but I'm going to combine those two uh, questions with one answer. My job is taking care of my mother who's very sick so <clears throat> yeah that's why I'm at home and I don't have a real job I am Count Kronos asks which band is the most metal of the metal Man of War or Amon Marth I can't pick but they're so metal it hurts um Isabel Milk Hotel so how do you like your cornflakes well, sometimes I'm like, I'm uh, crispy, but most of the time I like them uh, soft. Uh, Rockstar Base 100, favorite album of all time. That's a three-way tie with uh, Winter Sun's self-titled debut, um, Agalock, The Mantle, and Celtic Frost Monotheist. But if I had to pick one, Celtic Frost Monotheist. Uh, Poe Noob. What's a band you listen to that you wouldn't tell anyone else you listen to otherwise? Megan Dia. I'm not gonna lie, I love that song, Monster. <clears throat> that chorus is so, so catchy. I mean, I listen to that on repeat, and it's embarrassing, but hey, whatever. And he also asks, what do you think of Isan's post-Emperor work in bands such as Pakelum, probably said that wrong, his solo project, and Harding Rock? Never listened to Harding Rock, but Pakelum is very good, and his solo project is uh, <clears throat> godly. I love it. Runner JMA asks, um, what bands do you feel are overrated besides 70 to 80% of the gent bands? Uh, Necrophages Dream Theater. <clears throat> Words cannot describe my disdain for them and their fans. It's sickening. And I may do a Necrophages rant sometime. I don't know. Uh, do you have any favorite bands out of the brutal death metal style of metal? Yes, Amagordus is amazing. Devourment. Uh, Nile, of course. Hate Eternal. Uh, abdominal putridity. Probably said that wrong. Um, pathology. They're very good. Um, dead meat. I like them. And last but not least, have you ever had a Philly cheesesteak? Yes. If so, how would you prefer it without green peppers? I freaking hate them. Cordana TV. Sorry about mispronouncing your name. 
What is the most abrasive band slash genre you listen to? Band, abruptum, genre, um, cybergrind. What's your opinion on Christian black metal? Black metal is a style of music and not an ideology or a religion. Anyone can play black metal, excuse me, and you can label it whatever the hell you want. Music is music. <clears throat> Three, with this year being a great year for U.S. black metal bands, do you think black metal will be taken a bit more seriously by foreign countries? No. Never will be. There's a European elitism, no offense to the Europeans that watch my videos, that has a very strong prejudice against anything American, let alone our black metal. And your opinion, what's your opinion on Mike Patton and fans that believe he's the most talented vocalist ever? They're fanboys, just like me, of Tom G. Warrior, and I don't like them. <clears throat> Skunky81, the Skunky81, I'm sorry, asks, how long did it take you to grow that beard? Nine months. First metal bands you saw live, Demon Hunter, um, Azalea Dying, and Shadows Fall. Not in the same bill, but but the first show I ever went to was uh, Mushroom Head and P.O.D. Uh, how long have you played bass? On and off, more off, for eight years. What was your first exposure to black metal? <coughs> Progenies of the Great Apocalypse by Demi Borgir and Medusa and Hemlock by Cradle of Filth from the uh, Headbangers Ball Volume 2 compilation. And then from there I was listening to uh, Sirius Satellite Radio's uh, Heart Attack it was at the time. And they were playing uh, Beyond the Pit, which is their extreme metal hour. <clears throat> they played Immortal, which changed my life. So and it was Blash and Mighty Raven Dark in case you're wondering. Uh, you play bass, what brand of amplification do you prefer? I love the sound of Ampeg. It's uh, the most perfect bass tone. Uh, if you could pick any five guys from any existing metal bands to form one supergroup, who would be in it? Um, drummer from Internet, I can't think of his name offhand. Um, bass, that's a very tough one. I'm going to have to go with, I can't remember the name of the bassist from uh, Opeth, but he's amazing. Um, <clears throat> Michael Eckerfed on guitar and vocals, Jonas Rinsk on vocals from Catatonia, of course, and Yari Medipa from uh, Winter Sun on guitar and vocals. Favorite horror films? The Texas Chainsaw Massacre series. Every single one of them. The original being my favorite. Um, Satan's Little Helper. That's a great movie, but it's really funny. Stupid, but funny. Um, <clears throat> Dream431CA asks, Many musical experts think that metal and classical are very close to each other musically. Both genres are generally very melodic. And a lot of the emotions from both genres come from mostly the melodies and not so much the lyrics. What is your opinion on the metal and classical theory? I don't really have an opinion, but <clears throat> I have to say when I do listen to classical, I can hear a lot of similarities in metal, specifically structure and the bassiness of a lot of classical. And uh, the melodies I can definitely hear, and when I listen to classical, I think of how I could put a guitar riff to it, so... And uh, finally, my little meth lab asks, what are your thoughts on church burnings? Varg wanted to put a fist in the face to Christianity and harm it. He made it stronger, so what he did was counterproductive. My opinion on it is that, honestly, if you want to harm a religion as big as Christianity by burning churches, you can't just burn three of them. Three, four, five, six, seven, or eight. You have to do like a hundred at a time. And I'm not endorsing that, but that's just the truth. If you want to harm him, that's what you do. But that's my last question for this video. Um, part two will be next, so stick around for that. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And as always, keep it mellow.